All right, so a lot of people get asked how to deal with tall fighters like myself. But what about us tall guys? We're often facing guys that are extremely athletic, explosive, trying to get in and through our range, like the Muay Thai guy, Sean Fagan here. So we need tactics ourselves. And these are the three tall guy Muay Thai tips on staying long, keeping them away at that COVID distance. All right, so Sean is here trying to get real close and I don't like that. So this is pattern number one, utilizing our lead side and our really long weapons to establish our range. We are going to do this by throwing the teep. Boop. Then we are going to fake the teep into the jab. How I do this is pushing my ass forward here. So a lot of times guys will fake the teep and fall through, bringing their head forward. Don't do that. Keep yourself nice and long. Pop that hip forward here and then bam, pop the jab. Then I look like I'm gonna pop the jab again. And I actually throw the teep. Bang. And now, most of the time, this pattern will elicit a response, and that response is them coming forward at us. So once I finish this pattern, I'm going to fake the teep once again and angle off. So you're trying to trick them with these two move movements. One, they have to cover to the head, opening up the body. The other one, they have to parry, so they're dropping their hands. That's where the jab comes in. They get frustrated, they come forward. We cut the angle. But first, teep, fake the teep, jab, fake the jab and teep. They come at us and we pass. Teep, um, boom. Number two, I am the longer fighter. My opponent tries to cover the distance by exploding and leaping in with a hook or an explosive combination. You can cut the distance a lot of the times. Walking slowly on our back foot can get us caught. Recently, Francis Ngannou cut Rosenstruck, who's a much better kickboxer, but someone that was just backing straight up. We can do this, but we have to do it in the same explosive manner that the shorter explosive fighter comes at us with. So I'm here, Sean is going to dip and try to explode for the hook. And what I do is I slide back, I push up my front foot, and when I land, I want my front leg pretty much facing outwards and ready to pop for the kick. So just try to pay attention to my body and my feet as I shift backwards. So he comes for the big punch. Bang. And the third and last one, my opponent is getting through my range. I'm doing all these different patterns and tricks to keep them. At the end, they're cutting up the ring. They're doing a good job. We run out of space. We have to throw something. They're inside our range. What I love to do on this one is do damage and also take away that explosive power that is coming at us and use it against them. My opponent comes with this tight guard ready to attack. Instead of sliding back on this one, because I have no more room inside the ring anymore, what I'm gonna do is wrap my hook around. Instead of hitting the head, we have longer limbs. It's hard to generate power this close. So I actually miss on purpose, wrap around, make sure I step here, and then I pop the knee in as I pull his body in at the same time. If you're a orthodox fighter, you actually want to switch the southpaw for this. So we're here facing each other. Sean is orthodox. As he steps in, I step around and I hug here. He's here, he comes in, boom, and go with the knee. Now, when he's down here, we wrap around here. Make sure that you're not kneeing straight up like this. You wanna flare your ankle out to the side this way. Is the pointy part of your knee here going into the solar plexus, the liver, or even up to the head. Gee. All right, so those are three different tricks that you can use as a tall guy from the long range or if they get inside your range. I essentially wanted to give you a trick to use in each situation. 
If you want to see an entire striking system dedicated to being a long fighter, it is going to be coming to the Striking Academy that you can check out here. And if you want to just keep learning from free videos with no structure, then you can check out some of our other tutorial videos.